Hey everybody, it's Christo with Remax Gold and happy Tuesday to you. I thought I would just make a quick video and uh, kind of go over the showing pro protocol now that we've uh, pretty much opened up uh, California as of June 15th. And I'm sure you're seeing open house signs everywhere. And so I thought I would just uh, make a quick video and kind of let you know the protocol uh, for open houses and uh, kind of what to expect when you are looking at homes on the weekends and at nights and should you be wearing masks, should you not, um, and uh, the seller's requirements. So as of right now, as of making this video uh, after June 15th, um, it is no longer required for buyers to sign a PEED form, which is the property entry advisory forms uh, that we all had to do uh, prior uh, to June 15th, um, stating that we are not sick and that to our knowledge we have not uh, been next to somebody who has. Uh, so that was required uh, before seeing any property filling out that form, sending it to the seller and listing agent, as well as setting an appointment. Now those forms have been done away with. So we no longer are required to fill out those forms, those property entry advisory forms. We are no longer uh, having to distance ourselves during an open house. However, uh, it is uh, required for you to wear a mask if you are not vaccinated. So if you are going on a showing appointment, with just you and your realtor and you know that you are all uh, vaccinated, there's no need to wear a mask. However, if you are at an open house and uh, there are many people there, uh, it's best to be safe, wear a mask. You don't know who is vaccinated and who is not. So um, that is uh, new uh, as of June 15th. The other thing to bring up is sellers. Now sellers have the right to, um, uh, to uh, have all buyers wear masks, even if you're vaccinated or not. So they have the right to uh, look at proof of vaccination. They have the right to um, uh, have appointments set and no open house. So it's really up to the sellers as of right now, as far as how open houses are to be held and if you need to be masks or mask up or not. And they usually have that conversation with their listing agent. So if you have a couple of showings on a weekend, on a Saturday, and you're looking at multiple homes, it is definitely a possibility that there will be requirements for those different homes. So you may need to wear masks in one home, even though you're vaccinated and the other homes uh, don't require a mask. So it's really up to your agent to do the due diligence to make sure that they talk to the listing agent um, before going in the home. What are the requirements to go see the home? Uh, we again, still wanna be safe. So if the seller is requiring masks, um, um, vaccination results, uh, they are definitely entitled to do that. So anyway, I thought I would just make a quick video, let you know we are still not out of the woods as of yet. There's still gray areas. We're still trying to work out, uh, but we are definitely doing our best to uh, make everybody uh, still safe, um, keeping our family safe, our community safe. And for your information, I've put the link to the California Association of Realtors um, uh, showing guidelines down below so that you can read uh, directly from uh, the California Association of Realtors uh, for your information as well. So if you have any questions, let me know. 707-338-1622. And again, this is Krista with Remax Gold. Take care. Bye-bye.